Fortnite Chapter 3 is awesome. And on today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can go ahead and get yourselves the boss Spider-Man's mythic item in Fortnite. And also, we're gonna eliminate all the mythic bosses and get their mythic items and open all the five different vault locations in Fortnite. So drop a like and subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on if you wanna know how to get the Spider-Man's mythic item. And also, I'm an epic partner, so use code GARU in the Fortnite item shop. On today's video, I'm gonna show you guys the boss Spider-Man's mythic item and how you guys can actually get it for yourselves. On top of that, we are gonna eliminate each and every single mythic boss there is and get their mythic items. So right in front of me, we have got ourselves the foundation boss so we are gonna go to a high ground and eliminate him once and for all so that we can get his mythic items right now you also got to be super careful when you're also trying to take down the foundation boss because yes he actually has his mythic abilities where he literally throws rocks at us so you got to be super careful whenever he's doing that just make sure you make a ramp and then have a bit of high ground so you can always have some leverage behind you Alright, the boss is super low right now and we can get our hands on another mythic item right now. There we go. Another ramp made and we can easily take him out. Also, make sure you have a bit of ammo with yourself because, yeah, if you're missing your shots, that is going to be really tough. Alright, another round to go. This is going to be a piece of cake. Thank you very much. Please don't come close to me and we can take down the boss foundation right now. Okay, his shields are gone right now. Which is going to make this thing a bit easier for me to eliminate. Alright, don't come in closer. Because if we are super close to him, his mythic item, yes, it does a lot of damage. And we don't want to get eliminated. Alright, there we go. We're almost done. We don't have much ammo though. So this has to do it. Alright, even we are out of shields right now. So I'm going to go to a bit of a high ground. Alright, the boss is literally below me right now. And he's just looking at me, trying to figure out... Where exactly am I while I'm literally above him with next to no ammo on my weapons? Alright, it is time for round number two and the bond should be super low. There we go. He's super low. Whoa, but this time he actually hit us. We gotta be a little bit more careful while we're trying to eliminate him. But hey, thankfully we have got ourselves the shotgun and this is gonna make our job a bit easier right now. There we go. You gotta be super careful because otherwise you're gonna get a ton of fall damage and he should be one more hit. And there we go, the boss foundation has been knocked out and he's actually going towards his uh, teammates right now so that he can be revived. But guess what? We are gonna take his mythic item as well and open the secret vaults right now. Alright, where are you going buddy? Give me your mythic item and yes, there we go, we have got ourselves another mythic item right now with us. As you can see, this is the Foundation's MK7 Assault Rifle, which is the new mythic item in the game right now. So from here, we're gonna go ahead and take this mythic item and we're gonna hunt down some more mythic items. Thanks to Birdo, we can actually have a look at the Spider-Man's mythic item. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how exactly this is obtainable. So right now, we are gonna go to our next destination and as you can see, the Spider-Man's mythic item, they are pretty awesome, especially if you gotta travel long distances right now. And as you can see, no one can even catch up with the speed of the Spider-Man's mythic. These are the new items that were mistakenly added by Fortnite as an early access. And as you can see, we have now arrived at our next destination right now. Whoa, have a look at this. We have got some more henchmen over here and that only means one thing that means mythic vault and i'm gonna show you how you can open a mythic vault all by yourself and then we're gonna go ahead and grab a chicken just like this and then we're gonna go all the way down just like this and there we go as you can see we actually have two players right now just because of us holding a chicken so we're gonna go ahead and leave the chicken right now and yes there we go we are opening the mythic vault all by ourselves right now so let's go inside and let's check it out we have also got our pet chicken with us who helped us open the secret vault and there we go we have so many amazing items all for us so we are gonna go ahead and pick these items right now shield up and we are gonna go to our next destination from here 
where we can open another secret vault and meet a really awesome boss in the game. So right now from here, we are going to travel to our next destination right now. And as you can see, yes, the Spider-Man Semitic item is super, super helpful. I'm going to show you more gameplay of it in this entire video and all of its special abilities that you guys can actually use in this update of Fortnite. And we have arrived at our next destination right now. And yes, at this place, we can find another mythic vault right now. This is the 7 outpost number 2. And this one is quite special because yes, if you go downstairs, you can see that there's gonna be a mythic vault right over here. So right now, I'm gonna show you another strategy with which on how you guys can go ahead and open a secret vault right now. So first things first, I want you guys to go ahead and hit this henchman and then go all the way downstairs, okay? We're gonna go ahead and take care of her really quick. And now that she has been knocked out, we're gonna go ahead and carry her just like this, okay? And then we're gonna go downstairs just like this. And we are gonna put her in front of the vault and wait for it, wait for it. There we go. It has been done. So you can go ahead and easily open the vault and then also take down the other henchmen. And in this way, you guys can open the secret vault without anyone around you and have a look at that we have opened our second mythic vault right now let's go ahead and open all of it up there we go pretty awesome stuff there we go some more stuff and there we go some more amazing stuff for us well from here we're gonna go to our next destination right now where we can find some amazing mythic bosses and also open their vault locations so right now from here we are gonna go ahead and travel to our next destination right now and well we have arrived at our destination which is the seven outpost number five and over here we have actually got some secrets so if you go downstairs you will actually see that there is another secret vault so from here we are gonna go ahead and use the web slingers and we are gonna go to our next destination and open another mythic vault right now we're in the desert biome at the very far corner and if you go downstairs at this location as well you can find the fourth secret vault in the game so we are going to go ahead and use the web slingers again to go to our next destination and after we go ahead and show this destination with the secret vault i'm going to show you guys how to get the spider-man's mythic item so right over here you guys can see that if you go downstairs again at the seventh outpost so anywhere you see a seven outpost that is going to be the location of the secret vaults so from this place greasy grove is pretty close so we're going to go ahead and use these whip slingers again to go to our destination right now so right at greasy grove i want you guys to get inside this shop and basically inside you can actually find the guaco npc boss so if you go down and talk to the guaco boss you will actually see on arenas that he actually gives us the amazing spider-man's mythic item but if you go ahead and talk to him in a normal game you will see that he actually gives us the chili chug exotic item as well this mythic item is pretty awesome because with this you can actually go ahead and pull objects closer to you and as you can see the spider-man's mythic item is one of the best item in the game and as you can see traveling with this mythic item is pretty fun and it can actually save you a lot of time you guys can actually find this mythic item from a lot of different other places as well other than the guaco boss so you guys can go ahead and talk with one of the cuddle team leaders and well they can also sell you the mythic item for 400 gold on arena now well sometimes it might not even show up because fortnite is actually adding mary jane into the fortnite game as an npc and from her as well you will be able to obtain this amazing mythic item for 400 gold as well and as you can see whenever you have this mythic item equipped you will have a pickaxe sort of thing in your hand which are the mythic items and well if you use the mythic item on the spider webs you can see it will also give you an increase in momentum right now in the game which is pretty awesome you can also slide with them and another interesting thing that no one is going to tell you about these mythic items is that yes you can actually go ahead and avoid fall damage as well in the very last second so the best place sell to get this item is definitely gonna be on arenas so definitely make sure you go ahead and get those gold because you can see how fun this mythic item is to actually use and swing around the entire map which is also gonna help you travel and also dominate the entire game with the brand new boss spider-man's mythic item in fortnite 